Now, here is what you can do if your iPhone looks like this, if it's zoomed in, and if this is what you can do to uh, actually zoom it out, because this happens when you have the zoom feature enabled. It gets enabled with a double click with the other three fingers, so usually you're going to go like this, and to zoom it out, you have to double tap using the three fingers at the very same time, so you're going to go like this and it just zooms it out like that as you could see the first try did not even work so i mean you just have to make sure that you do it correctly anyways if you want to zoom it in just have to like this repeat the gesture or also just grab three fingers and move around the screen double tap but don't let go you can zoom in and out this is the feature which is probably enabled i mean of course if you do it it's naturally enabled but if you don't remember as you turn it on then you probably had it turned on by accident or something but if it bothers you you can also just disable it so what i showed you right now is just like a quick fix like short-term fix because it can happen to you that in the pocket it's gonna go like this and if it annoys you you just have to always zoom out and stuff so you have to do it manually however if you want to disable it altogether you can do it very easily in the settings so you open up settings and come back to the main section so here is the general main settings page now scroll down until you see accessibility in the older devices it used to be part of the general but now we have the accessibility in here and you have many different things but first of them or second is the zoom feature i have it uh, enabled of course so uh if you disable it like you can see right here are you sure you want to disable it yes now nothing happens you cannot just zoom it in using the gesture anymore if you tap on it it just zooms it in automatically to make sure that you know what's going on but you can also choose because for me is the full screen mode when i zoom in the entire screen gets um magnified so the zoom region can also be window zoom like this you can see that i can move it around and stuff and i have like a magnifying glass and i can put it here and i can also perform the same gestures and stuff but it's a bit different because um you can only zoom it in within that window i mean it's good if i want to show something or share something in the video perhaps but you probably may not be really excited about that feature for you i would advise you to just keep it on the full screen or if you don't want to use it just disable it completely then you have the zoom controller so let me show you what that is i keep it disabled so if you zoom it in there's like a thing that pops up on the screen you can see this is the controller so i can just move around i don't have to use the three fingers so that's the thing that shows up on the screen i personally don't really like it that much but yeah you can also just tap on it and zoom out choose region choose filter you can for example choose the grayscale if you want to like have a black and white uh, screen for some reason so oh, there are some options i definitely keep the controller disabled and this is how it is so these are all the things that i think you should know about it and this was most importantly the thing that you had to do if your phone screen is zoomed so hope this video helped you out for more content like this make sure to subscribe to foxtech and also check out this video right here thanks a lot see you in the future